I, I don't think anybody in their right mind wants a direct military confrontation with Russia. The problem is that we in the West do not see Russia as Russia is. We see it through this distorting lens. We either impute to it Soviet-like attributes or uh, evil attributes, whatever you want to call it. We tend to view it through the lens of our own notion of economic power and wealth. And you, you reach utterly false assumptions about Russia. Assumption number one, Russia is really weak. Russia can't stay the course. All we have to do is double down and we'll attrit them. We'll wear them out. No, it's the exact opposite. That's an impossibility, as they've demonstrated already economically. Secondly, their military is no good. It's no good because when they came in, they were soft. They didn't come in hard. They didn't do very well. They seem to have been defeated, all of which is erroneous nonsense, completely misunderstands what Putin was about, what the Russians were trying to achieve. So they believe in their heart of hearts that if we were to show up on the battlefield in Western Ukraine, cross the Polish border with Polish allies, maybe some Romanian forces too, that the Russians would be so intimidated and so afraid that they would immediately say, stop, let's stop. Please don't come into this. And they're wrong. They're very wrong. In fact, there's a real appetite in Russia, to be perfectly blunt with you, to do, do real damage to our forces if they get the opportunity. So I think you, you've got a misapprehension of the danger and, and the level of response that it will elicit. And now we have a much larger, very different Russian army in the field. This is now a wartime theater. Ukraine is no longer being treated with kit gloves. Uh, initially, they, they said, no, the Ukrainians are our brother Slavs. We don't want to harm Ukrainians. We don't want to do damage to infrastructure. We want to get along so that we can build a new peace. That's gone. The Russians now have decided there is no way to negotiate an end to this. No one will negotiate in good faith. Therefore, we must crush the enemy. That's what's coming. 